She's a chuck in the vapor. What is going on guys, ShitterXOI here coming at you with a brand new video and I'm going to be doing a review of the Tobacco Zorro. I don't know if I pronounced that right, Tobacco. Tobacco, you know, T-O-B-E-C-O, -E Tobacco, whatever. Of the Zorro RDA, alright, it's a little, a little RDA, not bad though. Does a good job, you know, very good beginner RDA if you're trying to learn to build on. Um... Not gonna try and make this a long video by going in depth with the build I have in here, but you know, pretty much I only have a I just have a dual parallel 22 gauge sleeper build seven wrap around a 2.4 millimeter screwdriver. So if you want to replicate that, you can, and you know. Not bad when I have a fresh battery in at least. Um, but pretty much it's it's a good little RDA it has bottom airflow your airflow comes right underneath hits your coil pretty good um, post holes are probably like 2.5 millimeters maybe three the middle one's probably three the positive connection three post design big airflow um, you know not too much to say about it it's a good little RDA especially if you're just learning to build on with the uh, holes being so big the post holes you shouldn't have much problem there and then you know you can pull the uh, top cap, chuff cap off right there it has some o-rings so if you have something that fits you can throw that on um, one of the cons that I do want to say though is when using this device if you use it for a while the metal part right here the chuff cap isn't very long or big, so if your lips accidentally touch this metal part, if you've been vaping, vaping it for a while, um, it might, you know, hurt a little bit, might get a little hot, but other than that, it... It does what it's supposed to. It has good flavor, depending on how you build. Uh, good vapor production, good dense vapor clouds. It's not a cloud chasing Addy by all means, but... If you're looking for something that, you know, well, this is going to burn through juice, so it's not a great build. But if you build, you know, something just to, you know, sit back and, you know, while you're watching TV or, you you know. That was shitty because my button fucking. You know, something like that. It's a perfect little RDA, but. If you're going to cloud comps or you know it's even good for tricking I guess you could say due to the fact that it's you know it produces dense clouds which means you'll get pretty good uh, vapor in your mouth for dense O's Let's see if I can but You know, good little dense fucking O's. Obviously, I'm not really trying, and there's airflow in this room, so doing the best that I can, but it's a good. Fuck, dude. I had to review this mod, but battery's kind of dying too, so. It's a good little Addy. I don't know what I can say really too much about it, but it does what it's supposed to do. I don't want to take up too much people's time. For 25 bucks, where I bought this at Four Humors Emporium, I would definitely buy it again if I lost it, you know, because it's a good three post design. It's my only three post design Addy that I have. So for 25 bucks, not a bad vape at all, um, you know, especially. If you build good, you know, it'll, it just eats up builds though, you know, you can throw fuse claptons in there, dual fuse claptons, parallel builds, whatever, 
It'll eat them up. It'll probably even take 18 gauge if you have something that can read 18 gauge. Probably if you had like a series uh, mech mod or something like that, it probably would. But. You know, not a bad little vape. Does what it's supposed to do. And, you know, what can I say? I'm overall pleased with the performance. Uh, post holes, the screws are Phillips head screws. They're pretty big, as you can see. So, also, it's a pretty big bore that you're sucking into. So, not very, pretty small little top cap, but... For a small RDA, it does what it does a, a crazy good job. Um, definitely would buy it again for 25 bucks if I lost it or broke it or something somehow. Wish they would send some more O-rings because the O-rings over time they do kind of uh, collapse and get pinched. So that's a little it just has to be mentioned. Uh, it does sit flush on all my devices. This my Mac mod though to get it to you know fire correctly, I have to my like pin right here has to be touching, you know, or has to be close to the battery, and I'm not going to go into that, but if I loosen this bolt up down here and let it sit flush, it'll be like, it'll be like that on my Mac mod, it won't tighten all the way down, so, you know, it sits flush though on the art, on that, on my, uh, Segelli over here, sits perfectly flush, no issues, don't even have batteries in it, so... But it's a good little RDA. I like it's what I've been using. This build's what I've been using for like the past week, and I've loved it ever since. Just sitting in my room playing Xbox, doing whatever. It's what I've been using, driving, whatever. I've loved this build. I love the uh, Zoro. It's done a great job. I highly suggest getting it if you're a beginner vapor. Uh, just make sure when you pack your con, you don't pack it in the airflow holes. If you do that, you're obviously not going to uh, end up getting any vapor because when you inhale because you're pretty much like vaping when you have the air holes completely blocked off so and you can adjust you know let me scoot that down you can adjust say you want like half opened or three quarters or maybe like a quarter open you can adjust all that you know just spin it but I, I leave mine wide open I like a good airy vape but it's a warm vape this build with that I have in here and a lot of the builds that I have had in here they've been warm so I don't know if it's the RDA but the RDA you know it produces a good warm vape so I'm going to wrap it up there I'll leave descriptions in the video or I'll probably leave a link where you could probably buy it for the cheapest I could find and yeah without that I will vape you guys out hopefully you guys enjoyed the video if you did go ahead please give me a like button all that support helps so much and you know Thank you again for 211 subscribers. I know I said it in my last video and I'm going to say it again, but thank you so much. Let's vape you guys out.